The image on the book's cover is the Helix Nebula, which is sometimes called the Eye of God or Odin Psi or similar names. The image and the name just seem like a perfect fit for my collection of short stories. It all goes back to Norse mythology, of course, where Odin was one of the main characters. He's sometimes called the All Father or the High One, and he is frequently depicted with only one eye. And the story of how Odin lost his eye has stuck with me ever since I read it as a child in a book called Asken Yggdrasil, or the Ash Tree Yggdrasil, by Swedish writer Alf Henriksson. Henriksson's version of this story is based on the Old Norse tales. And in the story, Odin wants to drink from a spring or a well of wisdom, but the water is guarded by a very powerful character called Mime, or Mim, or Mimir. Drinking from the well will give Odin great knowledge and wisdom, and it will also grant him the power to see into the past and the present as well as into the future. But of course, Mimir won't let him just drink the water, and Odin ends up having to sacrifice one of his eyes in order to do so. And in this tale, he actually has to leave his eye behind in the well. This story made a big impression on me, even as a child. And it came back to me when I was thinking of titles for the book. It was a story that seemed to fit rather well into the realm of science fiction on many levels. There's the idea of being able to see into the future, of course. And there's also the concept of losing something, of giving up something very precious, even maiming yourself in an attempt to gain knowledge.